There we go. Okay. So it locked up on you, your uh, your hamstring or your quad or what? Um, yeah, my hamstrings, just upper arms and everything. I've never felt my, my body shut down like that before. What do you think it was that caused that? Um, well, the doctors in there said it was just um, a little lack of nutrients, electrolytes and all that, so that probably caused it. Did you expect something like that on a cold day like this? Um, not at all. I was feeling great going into it. I, I do all my normal pre-race rituals, and... Um, so, no, I was not expecting that. Now, uh, you, did you see who won the mile? Uh, yeah, Craig Ingalls. He's, um, he's actually my roommate next year. And when I looked over and saw that, I, I got so pumped up um, to know that a fellow teammate and a guy that I'm going to get um, a lot of work with next year is just doing that well. And it really just set the bar for me, you know. I was like, all right, he did it, now I want to do it. So. so what was going through your mind when you took the lead in the 3K? Um, I was feeling great. Um, Coach and I talked about um, giving giving it a shot, and um, that's the only way to make it to another level is to take a shot, even if it'll kill you, even if it um, will mess your legs up, and like. But that's that's the way to get better, and that's what Coach and I wanted to do today, and um, I took it, so I don't regret it at all. So no regrets, um, so close though to the victory, and uh, just a, a darn uh, cramp, <laughs> or, or it would have been yours probably, right? Um, well, you never know what could have happened, but um, I sure wanted it. Well, congratulations on a nice run, third place finish, and uh, good luck in the rest of the season. Thanks so much. Sorry about that.